Now notice that when I was coming up, Ernell stressed that I had three minutes. <laughs> Looking at me all the time that he was saying it. Uh, I also see our public advocate here. I trust that we will, we will take note of that. Let me do three things in the three minutes that I have and then I get out the way. Uh, I must first things first remind everybody Memorial Day, three different holidays, Memorial Day, Veterans Day, and Armed Forces Day. Memorial Day is when we honor those who have not made it back home, who have perished on some forgotten part of, part of the earth so that we could gather together. That's Memorial Day. Veterans Day is when we honor those who have made it back home. They managed to make it back home. Thank God, I am one of them. Amen. Armed Forces Day is when we honor those who are currently serving in the military. Armed Forces Day. Having said that, I have a lot of words for a great person, but I'm not going to read them. Unless you want me to read them. No. <laughs> <laughs> All right. The councilman was kind enough to give me his time. I can read it. So I won't read them. I will say we, we love you kindly. We love you madly. And we wanted to stop and pause and say thank you for walking the line. We who know something about walking the line feel that you are honoring those people who fell by walking the line. So thank you. Thank you. All right. Yeah. To the Keepers of the Flame, I congratulate all of you for making sure that this tradition is done year after year. It is an honor to work with you. Uh, to tell you what we are doing up in, in uh, the Senate would take more than the three minutes because I'm on the Veterans Committee. And I can tell you about a ton of laws that I look forward to speaking with you afterwards but I'm going to try to have you not kick me and tell me my three minutes are up, although I can feel it. <laughs> Having said that, God bless you all, God bless America, and thank God for those who served and did not come home.